What is happening, y'all? Welcome back to another day, another stream. Got more <clears throat> No Rest for the Wicked on deck. Our, uh, our fat rolling adventures continue. Yes, we are fat rolling. Those that weren't here last time. Uh, some pretty interesting mechanics that you get when you're fat rolling in this game. Namely, boosh. You got a big old beefy shoulder check, and we can use that to ledge stuff. So, enemies running up on us, they get knocked into a ledge. Uh, very satisfying. It's probably the, the only time I've played a game where fat rolling has actually felt viable instead of being a huge risky de detriment. There we go, got the light on. So yeah, probably going to be a pretty chill stream today. Uh, I had lunch plans, but my buddy got busy with work, so looks like we're doing a, a DoorDash Poke Bowl. That steak and rice. Okay. Uh, let's see. So I think we're. Oh, this is new. Did they? I don't think they had icons last time we were playing. That's weird. Not gonna complain about it. Uh, I like icons. So where we left off, we were making our way through the sewers. We should be able to just hit this up and go right back to where we were at. Yes, okay. This area looks a little different. That's right. I, I, I saw this, ran for it, and then we wrapped up the stream. So let's... Brah, brah, brah. Damn, this thing is strong. Might need to put a couple more points in strength just to guarantee we're getting the kill off those things. So I remember killing those. That's right, I was coming this way. I had come up through here. I killed those guys. I saw that. Can't get up there. Okay, so we are just basically continuing on this way. Damn, fell short. Ew. still a new game came out uh released into early access yesterday so pretty new still uh, so we gotta find a way to get that oh yeah this is like this looks like the entrance almost is this the entrance yeah it is okay hang on well when we first came down here which way did we go we haven't gone that way, haven't done much over there. No way, we did do this. I remember doing this. <clears throat> I remember hitting the lever and then, no, I don't know. I found up a couple of them. Yes, this is only PC right now at all. Like we come to consoles after it has a uh, Finished its early access development cycle. Alright, so we need to find the sewer level handle. Where will we go? Can't go that way. Do we just go down? Down into the muck. Oh, 
I'm the Unga Bunga man. Scale oil. It's nice. Huh. Well, I know we don't go all the way back. That wouldn't make sense. Thing wouldn't be in that zone. Um. Bunch of stuff up there, so I feel like we gotta go that way. But we gotta find something to lower that bridge so that we can bro oh, hang on but there's a lever over there that looks like it might impact what we're trying to do right now how do I get up there to begin with there we go this looks promising Oh, you made a bunch of babies. Ow. No, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Oh my god, they just keep coming. What the fuck? Are you asking about the heal? The heal is a skill. You get that from, uh... From the... The rune person. It's one of the purchasable ones. Very nice. So as long as you have enough focus gain, you essentially have infinite heals while you're exploring. And I gain a lot of focus, so... Line on up, boys. Line on up. One big old schmack. I think this is the right way. We just gotta find the path to climb up there. And this looks promising right here. Hang on a second. Let me pan the camera out. It looked like a climbable wall right there. Maybe not. Hmm. Oh, duh. Just circle around. Initially, I had a, uh, when we first created this, this sword, the sword had, uh, healing effects decreased by 40%, but in exchange, like, indestructible, lots of incoming focus, and we had to lose some slots, and I'm like, alright, well, I got one extra slot, and then I saw the, uh, the healing things we could purchase, and I'm like, well, if healing is gonna be reduced... I probably want, you know, a healing aura or something that's going to offset that to make sure I can keep my health topped off. So I put that on. But then we pumped our healing effects up by 32% uh, with that. And then another 19% there. And uh, essentially negated out that negative. So now we just have a shit ton of healing. And our health is always full. Which is dope. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's very, once you, like, the, from, from what I can tell so far, given this is with about five hours played of the launch version so far, once you get going, it very much has a make-your-own-build <clears throat> type uh, appeal here. So, so we have, you know, our main weapon, which right now we only have one. But you can unlock additional slots, so I could be able to, like, hot swap and, like, be a rogue for a little bit. Or a sword and board or a mage or whatever. But right now, the, the extra slots, I unlocked more space here. Because I was always popping out of materials. But so you can make your own weapon. And then your weapon can have up to four abilities on it. This one, I sacrificed two of the ability slots to be able to, like, get a, a rando enchant on it. Um, but you can... Slot you can slot in multiple abilities, and then you also have the gems. This this has that's the uh, attacks deal sixteen percent extra cold damage, and then I put a gem in there for an extra five percent, so twenty one percent cold damage. So there's there's some pretty good customization here between like being putting the specific abilities you want on your weapon, and you know you still got like a little bit of RNG. Like rolling, rolling on your weapon to to get something you want and hoping for the best. Once we get out of here, we'll we'll probably have some. Um, this area is a higher level, so I'll probably either find some really cool gear or come into possession of some stuff that I can gamble. And gambling gear is pretty cheap. It costs one silver to like take a piece and upgrade it, and I'm at almost nine silver. So. You know, you're not doing it that often, so I think the the price point to do it is uh, pretty accurate. Oh, I was supposed to Let me go ahead and lower that. I mean, we've already started investing our stats into primarily strength. Well, we, our biggest focus has been health and stamina so far. We're at 16. I don't know if I would really consider that to be a, a huge investment in strength. But we'll uh, we'll figure out a good secondary. Right now, my current plan is to focus my stats on what my character is already doing the best. Damn, it's hard to get to that time. Um, oh, did I? That's why I can jump. So we're, we're gonna focus, we're gonna, right now my focus is the basics, so I'm gonna get health up to 20, stamina up to 20. I might start getting my focus a little bit higher as well, maybe a little bit in equip load. And then damage stats, we're gonna do those as we find weapons, so. Nope, we, we missed the jump. Can I jump through from here? Alright, so I gotta go to that little ledge. Is there a way to get gold easily? I keep dying to gravity and losing durability. I just... I've just been, like, adventuring. And I haven't had any issue with gold. I just keep adventuring. Uh, I sell old gear. Selling, selling gear you're not gonna use actually nets you a... A ton of currency. Ooh, barely made it. Barely made it, but made it. Like, if I go... Well, I don't have much gear right now, but, like, that's worth almost the silver. Like, these two, that's like a silver and a half between the two of them. This one, I'm probably gonna... I don't know, I'm debating if I want to equip it. Focus, healing, and speed is great, but stamina decreased by 20% is rather iffy. That's what, level 11, and we're at level 9, so it'll be a while before I could use it anyway.
This is probably the slowest the game goes, because we're playing you know, heavy two-handed weapon, bat rolling, big unga bunga. Probably supposed to grab that thing before jumping all the way down, but it's done is done. I don't think there's an easy way to get back up. So we gotta do this again. Let's go uh, get that to 20 and pump a little bit more. Oh, sorry, getting two perver now? Two, one, one. All right, so one point is actually great here. This or Stellar Blade? I mean, they're two very different games. I wouldn't put them in competition as well, considering one is a PlayStation exclusive, one's a PC exclusive. One is an early access action RPG, the other is a... Uh, story-based action-adventure game. It's like asking if you want pizza or pasta for lunch. Like, yeah, they're both going to be filling, but like, shouldn't really be comparing them. I don't know if I can parry that attack. Unga bunga. Unga bunga. A lightning on parry was pretty nice. I'm gonna see something here. Hold up. So I can individually charge each attack. It's kind of sweet. stamina. I think the durability system needs a good tweak. There's a lot of people are complaining about it. I haven't particularly had issues with it outside of tools. Tool durability seems rough, but once you get better tools like iron, I don't think it's as much of an issue. I get it though. People, people don't like durability systems. But like the big thing with durability... So like, well, like I just died, right? I just died. I don't know if I'd lose durability on. All right, so we our durability is looking iffy across the board. You know, maybe twenty percent. So this is how easy it is to deal with durability. I think a lot of people just aren't aware of stuff yet. Many thanks. 
There we go. Durability's fixed. So like, yeah, it's still annoying, but it's not that bad here. I mean, that that took us what twenty seconds to address. Like, oh, we died. Our durability is getting low. It's it's gonna break soon. Well, you can fast travel to town. The blacksmith is right there. It's like a ten second run. You repair it, and you know that's it. You're done. So, like, I get why people don't like durability, but. The more I have played, the more I have found it to be a non-issue. I guess that's a good way to put it. There is an item to repair in the field. I don't I don't have any on me right now, but I usually usually I like to keep uh I like to keep one on me. Just for situations where it's like, oh my shit's gonna break. I need to I need to repair this. But I think, I mean, honestly, it's the thing is when you're in day one of a game, it's hard to take generalized complaints like that seriously because I think a lot of it is just people not being aware of game mechanics. Like, I was talking to, to Endel last night, uh, and he said that he was watching Baru play a little bit. And he said that Baru was complaining about inventory space and, you know, how he, how he had no inventory space and, you know, nowhere to put his shit. And he had just gotten to the rookery and he finally got the chest, but the chest is too far. And it's like, that's exactly how I felt before getting to the rookery. But once you get to the rookery and you get that very first upgrade, you can get to the chest super fast so it's like before that point i agree yeah my inventory is always fucking full but once you get that it's no longer an issue like just to to show that real fast because we are pretty full on uh you know it's so like this this I have, I have plenty of slots but it is getting more full you know if my inventory was full and i wanted to to deposit shit where was the uh where's the cairn Where is the edge? There it is. So, just right here. Kill men for free when you can be paid to do it? So, pretty quick run. Now we're at our, our lodgings. We can deposit our stuff. But, like, before you get that upgrade that gives you that run, you need to, like, climb all the way up through town, and that's super fucking obnoxious. Like, before you have that upgrade, it seems like a pain in the ass. You know, just to, to show what I'm talking about. Before you, you talk to the dude, and you get that upgrade, if you wanted to go to your chest, instead, you would have to run this way. And then run this way. And then run this way. And run this way. Taking the old fortress. And now we're there. Now that that's that's wild. That's you know, that's that's like, oh man. You know, if you're just trying to get to your inventory, that's a fucking trek. But that's the thing, like, once you have the upgrade, it takes 15 seconds. Before you have the upgrade, it takes, like, a minute and a half. And so that's, that's probably the best exemplification of 
the point that what I'm saying, you know, I think people just need to spend some more time and engage with the mechanics in the game. Because you know? before you have that, you're like, oh man, that's that's terrible. That's I'm running so far. That sucks. Once you have that, it's a non-issue. Um, I don't need that sword. Which actually, I should check in on uh, Builder Man. Bruce wood, iron, and clay. I have a lot of that, but it's all in my, my chest. Why kill men for free when you can be paid to do it? Which game would you play recently with the best quality of life features? Like inventory management, fast travel. Um, I don't know, maybe... Hang on, uh... I don't know, it's hard to say. I, I played so many games. I think, didn't Power World have, like, crafting where it just teleported from your base and got used? That's, that's good quality of life. Up on that pipe, what are you doing, man? Don't you drown? Climb up. Gnarled saw. Show me. Two handed sword. More damage, less impact. It weighs more. Requires 22 strength. As limb limit break. Uh, well, I guess we're going to get our strength up. Stronger. 26? That's stronger than this, and this is upgraded out the ass, so... If we enchant that, it probably turns into a fucking monster of a weapon. I do like that enchanting system a lot, because finding even, like, a white weapon, you know, most action RPGs... Most action RPGs, I get this, and I'm like, trash, I don't think about it again, but the fact that I know I can morph that into something crazy... I'm like, Ooh. it's poison. Yes, should have never lost the Potential for greatness. All right, so we're like at the very entrance of the sewers now. Equip load decreased by 30%? Hell no! Nah. Out of your goddamn mind. 
that is incredibly dooky. I want to see how bad it is. I feel like it would instantly. I guess it's because it weighs so much less. The armor value, 20. Why would anyone use that? Does this go further? That way, that's the exit. Uh, from what I've been able to tell, loot is like semi randomized. Like, there's Like, the boss drop you get, for example, that's gonna be randomized, but the boss is gonna have, like, a pool of potential loot. So you have an idea of what you're gonna get. Stop that. There a climb up point over here at all? No, there's not. Let's go back. You got a katana. Damn, 22 decks. Plague swirl. That's pretty cool. Hang on a second. I'm going to order lunch real fast. So the place just opened up. And I'm going to time out this fucking weirdo. I don't know who that is, but... And take your weird shit somewhere else. Uh, let's see. I want my steak bowl. And wife likes the tofu bowl. Then I'm gonna get a slushy. Mango pineapple slushy or strawberry peach slushy. Fuck. Let's go strawberry peach. This sounds super good. Alright, lunch is ordered. Mm hmm. I think I go. Oh, wait, no, I haven't been over there. That's got to be the path. Thought that was the entrance, but perhaps not. No, hang on. Yeah, because I remember looking at that and being like, how do I reach there?
That's probably where I go for the boss. No, we can't have slushy. Only I get slushy. Blood rusted sword, blue quality with a spin. Ten damage on parry, focus gain, items weight decreased. Be a solid like one hander and shield setup. that item or is that too low to grab it's too low to grab Was drained out. Please watch over me. Mother, make a seeker for safety. Please watch over me. Mother, make a seeker for safety. Where are we at anyway? Please watch over me. 245. Let me see how close I can get to a level. Seeker for safety. Please watch over me. Still quite far away. Seeker for safety. Very unnecessary. Ow, 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 ow. I'm dead. I gotta get rid of some of my shit. I was trying to get my good heals on deck, and instead it's like, hey, bro, you got like 40 mushrooms. No, I don't want to use the fucking mushrooms. Have you seen that guy before? Yeah. Yeah, we fought him last stream. No, no house yet. I'd imagine the house is either tied to us finishing this quest or us upgrading the town a certain percentage. Bunga! Bunga! Oh man, you're definitely stronger than before.
Oh, my stamina hurts. No, 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 no. Shoulder check. Big sh Oh, he got out of all. I didn't get my big smack off. Big smack. Big smack. Oh, God, that hurts. Okay, we might need to run for a little bit. Uh, where's my heal? It's almost up. Oh, shit. He ran through it. We got the heal off, though. Probably need to parry your ass. Ow. Oh, god damn, this sword's so fucking big. God, the shield slam. Oh, God, the big boot. Oh, God, no. Damn. Damn. I think I want to. All right. We're going to. How's the durability looking across the board? Pretty good. All right. We're not even going to worry about attacking. I want to. I want to see if I can parry this boss. Because if I can parry his swings, this fight's gonna go very differently. But I don't know if I can. I'm parrying and it's not. Yeah, I don't think you can parry bosses. Which would be definitely a bit of an oversight from the devs. If you can't if you can't parry bosses, I think that would be that would be a legitimate criticism here because you have you have stuff like I have my focus gain comes from parry I deal damage based on parry you can't parry the bosses that suddenly invalidates aspects of builds oh no you can I gotta parry right there. That was his charge. So is it only certain stuff that you can parry? So I can parry his charge in. I can parry that, but I can't, I don't think I can parry the multi-swings. Ow. And there's definitely a tight window on it, because if you fuck up a little bit, he gets off a shield thing that smacks you instead.
Oh, fuck. Damn it, dude. I, I had it, and then he was like, Schmack time. Schmack time changed that real fast. Good date. Nothing sings like steel. Alright, well, let's upgrade this crazy sword real fast. I want to see what happens to it. Last two rune slots and last three gem slots. Yes. Fire level 11. Let's see what they turned into. The sword. Alright, so the leggings. Stamina loss on damage taken, but poise defense, overall speed, and focus gain. I like that. The gloves, focus gain increased in health on kill. I like that. Experience loss on death. 3% health is damage dealt, and attacks deal extra heat damage. Uh, so I wonder if experience loss on death is like you drop it or it actively goes down. Because of experience loss on death is just, you know, souls like. That's nothing. I'll pick my shit up each fight. Hello. Uh, weapon shard and copper ingots. Let me just buy the copper. I have some, but I'd just rather buy it. Oh, what is this? Sacrament Guardian. Tongue Splitter Blueprint. Oh, you got iron tools now too, bro? May your will be half as strong as my work. Extract spin. Extract plague swirl. Greeting. I wonder if the pulse of health thing is any good. Heal arrow is what we're using now. Okay, uh, so we're never going to use that. Those I might use. Let's see. I don't like the stamina decrease. So I'll use the other ones over you. Yeah, if I have one more level to use my new weapon. Good is a good date. Iron ingots. Nothing we need iron well. ingots. Save your return. Some people ask, warriors only as good as his weapon. Yeah, if I level up, that's that's a big difference. That's that'll become a level twelve weapon. Thank. Sarah. I mean, I'm, we can more than likely we can take down this boss, but I do kind of want to just fight something else and get my level. Just because if we get one level, we can use our new Ungabunga sword, and I kind of want to see what new Ungabunga sword does. Seeker, forsaken, 
Uh, the thing around my neck is just like a really good helmet. <laughs> it looks incredibly dumb, but it's also very good. You're so angry, bro. Ah, very tight parry window on that. So that's the one I can parry. Oh. Fat rolls. Damn it, too early. Ow. Running out of heels. Damn it, I'm going too fucking early. Why am I fucking this up so much? God. Very good. Very good. Oh my God, he hurts so bad when she gets angry. One more. Very good. Oh my god, what the fuck? Get away from me, bro! Oh, damn. <laughs> Wait, I'm dead? How did he hit me? What the fuck? Bro, what what just happened? I killed him, I thought. I thought he was dead. And then I died. I don't I don't know I don't know what happened there. Like, I don't- I legit- I'm just confused. Hold up. I need to go back- I, I needed one hit, and I thought I got him. Let me rewind stream here. What- what just happened there? What just happened? So he was swinging, he had no health. I was behind him, I s- The fuck? It looks like I hit him, and like- It looks like I hit him and, like, took damage from his shield. Like, his shield had thorns or something? I don't know. That's- that's fucking odd. That's very odd. Alright, we're just gonna play this mega safe and just parry God the whole fight. I definitely parried that. Bro, all right, the parries are kind of janky. And so is your reach. Definitely don't like his infinite amounts of poise that he gets.
Or his absolutely fucking insane reach. Could you calm down, maybe? Oh, God. Can I parry this face? What the fuck? So much trouble. This phase looks scary, but it actually seems easier. Oh no. I gotta get distance. I gotta get distance in a heal. Yeah, I need to just run and heal for a little bit here. I got my health up. I'm out of actual food and we're like using. I'm very uncomfortable. No, come on. Covered. We got our health back. All I need is like one good dodge. There we go. There we go. Cool. You're stressful. 
Malformed Skull, Human Hand, Plague, Iker, Falstead's Relief. No badass weapons. Fucking robbed. Ugh. Oh. Still stressful, but yeah, phase phase two wasn't as bad as phase one. His attacks were sloppy. Did that not I don't think we leveled up from that. Maybe turning in the quest. Impressive. This isn't a sewer anymore. It's a tomb. See? I knew it! Sacrament stands because of me! It wasn't your place, Serum, to make a deal with a prisoner. Nor perhaps my place to let you. But don't worry. He was never out of our sight. Tell them, Serum. I honored our deal. And an hero deserves an hero's pardon. <laughs> Sacrament doesn't bargain with murderers. You're headed for hard labor at the Mountain Gate, by order of the Madrigal. You shit-smiling bastard! <laughs> And you? Well, I think we understand each other, Serum. You and I, we do what needs to be done. Consider yourself a citizen of Sacrament. You've defended this city. Now, you may make it your home. That much easier to find you later. Do I get a house? Level up! I think. Yes. All right, hang on. My food just showed up, so I'm going to grab lunch.
you gotta do oh. Kid cracks me up. He's like, Dad said, I, I want to run on the treadmill. Just the, the idea of running in place is amazing to a child. They're enamored with it. Uh, how much strength did I need for that weapon? I need more than that, I think. Yeah, we ain't using you. Not yet. 22. Rip. Uh, let's put you on. Oh, those are even better. Stamina regen. Hey, I put the uh down there, Paige. Um, I mean, stamina regen is nice, but that is stamina regen and healing. I think I would keep my big, my big thing here. So healing, focus gain. I don't know. Let me get to town and I'll evaluate this stuff. I'm eating a poke bowl. It's a steak, corn, cucumbers, rice, and pineapple. I don't think I'll be telling Ellsworth you released that rat from his cage. But I won't be telling him my role in all this either. Thoughts, it's fun. Place, wait, where am I? Market, hello, what? Marketplace this way? On alert. I like to think of my position as it's not the marketplace, it's, it's weird. I 
should have been there. I should go get. Let me get all my mats, and then I'm gonna do some town upgrading. Oh, I kill men for free when you can be paid to do it. Let me take anything that's not food related. Hides left over. Maybe it's time you trade in that silly outfit for a uniform. I should have been there. Hang on a second. Bids enamored just staring at the uh, treadmill screen. Oh, hang on. All right. First thing I got to do, upgrade this town. No, first thing I want to do is check the amble out. Finding a copper ingot. May your will be half as strong as my will. So that takes time. Ernest, didn't I unlock the anvil as well? Yeah. May your will be half as Paul Bear Garb. Will. It's not that good. Nothing sings like steel. Warrior's only as good as his weapon. The other pieces are, but the weight's kind of high on them. Nothing sings like We need craft leather and wolf claws. Ah. Uh, Strong as my work. Awful stenches. Oh man. What can I extract these effects? I mean the fact that it has focus gain and healing effects. Focus gain and health on kill. Like Even with less defense, these just seem like a better pick.
Those are heavy. Let me try and um Make the world your weapon. Greetings. They're heavy. Cold resist, poise defense, stamina regen, and increased armor. Yeah, I mean, it, they pretty, pretty heavily outclass those. And then I can gem them up. They're heavy, but they seem solid. Electric resist, heat. Gain focus on focus use. Let's increase the armor further. So those are just armored up. They are mega armored. Extra heat damage. Items durability. Let's go heat on you. The warrior's only as good as his weapon. Fillmore can tell the me. I want you. I want your, I the other guy. May your will be half as strong as my work. Uh. Damn, you need iron ingots to upgrade that. I ain't got no iron ingots. Um, how much money do I got? Let me sell some some shit here. Nothing sings like steel. Sacramento, I felt. I felt the Wasn't there something about Hang on, let me see something. Wasn't there something about pulling gems back out or is it only pulling runes back out? Let me know. Make the world life and why why do you want to know my real name, bro? I don't know you. Why do you want to know my name? The desire to to have parasocial relationships with streamers is very weird. Are you sure you want to be running errands for that schema winning? He's got no honor, that one. Left his family in disgrace. It's true. Yeah. Go oh, enchant armors and weapons. I need like an excessive amount of pine wood.
think we're good. Let's check out upgrades. I mean, beyond beyond the the fact that you know there's there's stalking and doxing and all that my the, the reason i don't like my real name isn't a secret you know if i'm playing with the boys they'll call me by my real name Good day to but for me it's it's a uh it's about a level of familiarity like a good way to think about it is is like this like if I am playing a game and I'm playing it with people I know that I have been friends with for years, they're calling me by my first name because we're friends, because I know them. But if somebody I don't know calls me by my first name, it's a bit weird because I'm going to assume I, I know this person, you know? It's it's about a familiarity thing. Maybe it's time you trade in that like, I don't know you. I don't know who you are. Yeah, buddy. Good. Good job, buddy. You did really good. You did really far. But you know, it's like if I don't you know, if I don't know you and you're using my given name, that's weird. You get what I'm saying? Another example would be like, you know, if you take a look at like Japanese society, people are are typically referred to as their their family name. So if your name is is like if your name is say John Smith, you know, people that don't know you would just refer to you as like Smithson. Only people that that know you and are friends with you would refer to you as John because it means there's a level of familiarity, there's a level of comfort. It means like, hey, you know, I know this person, they know me. And that's that's ultimately all it boils down to. It's a very uh a very simple boundary about familiarity. Or like, you know, if your name's Jimmy, and someone, you have no fucking idea who they are, just comes up to you on the street, and they're like, hey, Jimmy, what's up? You're gonna be like, who's this guy? I've never introduced myself to them before. Why is this, why is this person calling out to me? Why do they know my fucking name? Think about how weird that would be. Same thing. Mm-hmm. Can you tell me your exact coordinates and your social security number? Yeah, sure. It's 420, 69, 69, 69. My coordinates are balls deep in your mom's ass. Imagine a bunch of grown men killing each other just to be a footnote in some scholar's book. Jesus. 
to my scissors? No, these are my scissors. A man with untainted blood is a man as fulfilled. I should have been. So much Why kill men for free when you can be paid to do it? This game is early access. But it does seem like there's a fairly large chunk of content already. Like, we've been going... This fucking thing is like, your Twitch connection has expired. No, it's not. Connection is not expired. Go away, Streamlabs. So we're just going to deposit all this for now. But I wanted to... Hold up. Does everything have gems? You got a gem... You got a gem. Healing, armor, electric armor. Yeah, I right, what's that? Is it all of it? Still don't know what the fuck these guys are for. Hang on to you. Oh, runes. I guess I could them or not, I don't think it matters. Bombs, poise, defense, focus, poise, defense. Let me go talk to the dude. I think I can get two upgrades. No, upgrades don't pull from your stash, which is one of my biggest complaints. I feel that universally all games should pull from all stashes when you upgrade. Doesn't matter what the context is. If I am at my, my rest spot, if I'm at the, the home base, and I have materials in my home base stash, it should come from there. No question. That should be how it is. Like my Streamlabs keeps fucking up. Busy, thank you for the Prime sub. Every time I get a Twitch notification, it's like, your Twitch authentication has expired. I'm like, no it hasn't. I'm seeing the notifications, fine. Please stop. Uh, equip load is tied to a stat. You have a specific... Stat. Oh, a quick load. Here. Yes, of but be careful. Little Sarah is under full. Who, Master? Uh Come, Sarah. All right, what upgrades am I getting? Gear inventory slots. Item. Resource. Mm hmm. I'm thinking either more resource slots or, oh man. I mean, the thing is resources are always being filled. I could have a second primary weapon. That could be good too. I haven't found a second ring yet, so that's pointless. I'm going to grab a sock because my one sock had a hole in it, so it has to go in the trash and I'll let y'all vote. What do y'all think I should get? Because really the only reason for a second weapon slot would be swapping between weapons mid-combat. I got so many rings early on, I got three rings. I've only found one ring so far. Where are you getting all these rings? Because I would consider a third ring slot if I'm going to start finding a bunch. Like, I consider the rings I would consider the, the highest priority, but I haven't been finding rings at all.
All right, mm -hmm. let's go. I think I have two of these upgrades, so let's go resources, and then let's also go ring. Wonderful. Give it here. Within this... I wonder how we respec. I'm gonna start using these poise vials. Or better yet, I haven't touched them at all. Let me go sell this shit. Let's go make some money. Nah, I'm trying out the slush today instead of the boba. It's, um... I don't know, I like the boba better. This just tastes like a, uh... Well, like a slushy. I mean, it's like a strawberry peach slushy, so it's very good. But I think I like the, the boba and the milk tea better. Did you get your home base? You can put chests. I have big problems with items. I mean, I have the rookery. I haven't gotten on my, like, home base yet. And the war room guy disappeared. When we picked up the other weekly quest, he just vanished. Kill men for free when you can be paid. Do it for good. Fleet builder projects. Collect pine wood. I need to collect so much fucking wood, dude. The wood costs need to be adjusted. The crafting should just come out of your inventory automatically. All right, grants 10 additional poise. Man, these are worth fucking nickels. I want to try one to see if it's actually good. I don't like stamina vials. I'm not using that. The bombs are good. The oils are good. Repair powder is good. Yo, a ring. Mm, I do have a ring slot. Let's buy it. Amthest. I'll wait till I find one. Oh. Armor increased by 24%. So I want to see my stats real fast. So I have 311 armor. Is this going to increase all my armor? Oh my god, it is. That's... Let's just increase your armor by a flat, huge chunk. It's kind of wild. Like Iker, I could go that way. Bits and pieces, pine trees. I'm kind of broke. Let's look at the bounties real fast. Maybe it's time you. I'd like to pick up multiple bounties too. Let me take like five. I need wolf parts so I could do that. 
Let's do that, and then we'll do this. Y'all on the thumb, the thumb dialogue. Everybody's a thumb. Leave the thumb people alone. I never did anything to you. Bunch of thumb haters out here. Everything was fine until the anti thumb nation attacked. Where am I going? What did I? I said I'm gonna kill wolves. Mariners keep. Let's just like straight ahead. Whoa, that looked like a big old catfish. Oh, that's like a monster. Never mind. That's definitely something that wants to fight. Turkey head? kind of cool how, how as we progress the quest like shit just evolves like we're finding enemies that were not out here before I got two from that I wonder if I'm going to start getting more more resources from trees Nope. Cut and all the fucking trees down. Yo, I got two trees out of that. Did I take out all my mushrooms and shit? No, I didn't. There's still a fuckload back at base. Challenges. Collect five pine wood. Haven't I? Am I not getting... Do I need to turn the pine wood into him? Because that's not fucking happening. I need pine wood for like every fucking challenge I have. Or every building project I have. I don't even give a shit about monsters. I'm just here for ore. Ore and trees, baby. Ore and trees. that wolf in half. Kidney. Wolf claw. Oh, 
Iron Man with all the gift subs coming in. Necessary. Holy shit. Ow, yo, bro, no. Oh, I'm still alive. Guy is super strong, bro. This calls for one thing. Bitch. Bitch. <laughs> Got his ass. What did he drop? Did he drop anything? Is there loot? Oh, definitely loot. Rip, I missed the water. What do we get for murdering him? Play Geiger? What the fuck? Okay. Uh, did not expect that, but, like, yeah, I'll take it. That's the upgrade, mats. That's awesome. Come on, bro. Climb up. Let's go. What are you doing? Just random mini-bosses out in the world? Camera angles feel fine. It's like any other action RPG. Close to a level. Oh, we're almost there. 893. We're, oh, no, 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 don't fall down. Damn. I would call it a soul's light, because there's no resource loss on death. Like, the combat definitely feels like a soul's game, but you're not losing... You're not risking your experience, which I think is a very core part of what makes a Souls game a Souls game. And I gotta kill, like, a crab when I level up.
Maybe there was a fast travel like right inside here. start getting our focus up. A new focus bar is granted for every 100 focus points. Dun 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 dun. Alright, this is a great chance to test something since we just, just died. So, right now we have we have 36 experience on the line. You fight me. Do I die and lose it or do I die and drop it? Because it says experience loss. Alright, so I now have three. So I guess I just lose it if I die. But is it percentage based? That's a little weird. I still got the heavy. I got, let me look at this. Let me get back to the, the rest spot. I'm going to warp out of here in a second. One, two, three. Hmm. Very different weapon. What does this do? Well, let's warp out of here. I want to grab my heals and we'll uh, figure things out from there. I'm going to probably keep my old weapon around. Only cuts. Uh, there's like experience loss. I don't really want to risk it, you know? Want crappy cloth gloves. So much past. Why kill men? And so little present. Do it for. Oh, he does want me to contribute them. No, bro, I ain't paying you shit. Turn in our wood. Let's get to work. Where's the enchanting place? Alright, enchantment shop will be done in an hour. Market the inn, restore health, potions and bombs. Do I want potions and bomb? Probably the, the general shop. Alright, I need four more wood. Maybe it's time you trade in that silly outfit for a uniform. Yes, I got a review copy for Stellar Blade. 
No, I'm not telling you anything about it. Of memberships. All right, so let's see food stuff. Food, 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 food. Okay. I don't know about my giant buzzsaw. It's strong, but I don't know. I kind of miss the the good old bunga bunga smash stuff feel. Wonderful. Give it to him. Within this. Well, let's get another ring slot. What the fuck? Open the door. Not slide. Open the door, bro. Correct. You're streaming on Twitch and YouTube. Even though YouTube is where I do all my streaming, Twitch gets a, a mirror stream. Because they nice. don't want to come to the superior platform. Cook stuff and sell some stuff. Oh, Actually, didn't this. you have a thing for mushrooms? You want mushroom soups? So I ain't giving you that. Maybe they know. All right. Get the fish. Let's make that. Uh, he fucking mushrooms. Maybe I should sell my mushrooms. I got more mushrooms than I'm ever gonna need. Do you have recipes, bro? Mushrooms, my guy. Got mushrooms for fucking days. Sacrament and doors. I've scoured the realm. Eyes up. All right, cool. Let's uh, eat these berries. Oh damn, I got 14 more mushrooms. Whatever. Let's use them to top off as I'm adventuring. I guess let's head on out to the new area. I'll see you. I give this game a rating of play. That means it is fun and you should play it. Meat chunk. Hang on, I can deposit a couple of these. Rough cut meat. So I don't have any recipes that are using full on meat chunks yet. So let's deposit those and other shit and then we'll be on our way. What game you played before that's close to this in terms of combat? Um V Rising. 
a little bit of the rising vibes. Yes, I'm wearing a stockade. It is very good. My stockade has 32% additional healing and 14% stamina regen, so I ain't taking it off. I don't care how goofy it looks. Stats are worth it. I am going to replay V Rising. V Rising hits full launch in May. I mean, I'm a side sleeper anyway, so the stockade's not a problem. Alright, let's see. So we don't need meat chunks or trout. I haven't found a use for those herbs yet. Everything else is good, though. Ooh, alright, let's head out. Actually, I'm going... Where's the other quest at? Sacrament. Um, travel through the Nameless Pass. Do I reach that place? something real fast here this is getting really annoying this stupid message the whole like your stream labs has expired I need to like log out of twitch on stream labs and log back in just so this stupid message will go away it's weird because i'm as far as i can tell i am i need to like Unauthenticate it and then reauthenticate it. <clears throat> oh no. Weird. Quite weird. Actually, before we head out, I'm gonna get my pants. Go oh, stream pants hype. All right. So do I just uh, let's go this way. I'll take this post any day over my old one in Havenport. Where do I leave? Or like, let me read again. Travel through the Nameless Pass northeast of Sacrament. I go up higher? I mean, I'm pretty high. One two is pretty good. Very quick. I smell fear.
Oh, too soon. I thought I felt it. Everyone says it's the thumb game because the characters have long faces. against against some people climb up here and get up there I can let's go this way first yes, the fire sword is quite awesome The revive mag. I don't know what that is. Damn. Fire sword said, "Sit the fuck down." health on hit or something 3% health is damaged out yeah I was gonna say I just like poised through that dude attacking me and was like I do not care all right that's actually fucking wild bro what the fuck yo watch my health as I'm fighting like the, it's supposed to be 3%. It's insane. Sure you want to head that way? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Something's about to break. Is it my tools? Oh my god. My woodcutter's axe and my pickaxe. Alright. We're gonna need... We're gonna need to go repair all that before we head out. Nothing that direction but a wrecked quarry, a closed gate, and I see Ellsworth marching with them. <laughs> they live in Orvin. Could you use some help with a farm, Orvin? Mainland looks down at her isles. Sacrament at those living outside. So that's the way we want to go. Is any of my gear at risk? 31. Dude, I really don't want to use my, my shit yet. My, uh... Heal up thingy. A repair powder. Alright, watch. I'm gonna let this dude hit me. Watch this. <laughs> Fuck. Holy shit. That's insane. There is... There is absolutely no fucking chance that doesn't get nerfed. Zero, zero percent chance that doesn't get nerfed. Yeah, literally, we're immortal. It's fucking nuts.
I haven't even been using the fire bombs and stuff. That's special, dude. I'm I'm just a god now. What the fuck? I mean, technically it is 3%, but the problem So uh it says 33, but I don't know how much it's... Let me let me see. We have damage numbers on, don't we? So, 15 and 6, I think is what I hit that guy for. Old cottage key. Yeah, maybe it's not 3%, because if we're hitting for 13 and 6, 3% would... Thumbs bugged. There's like a whole camp over there. How do I get over there? I want to go beat you up. I mean, there is no lost XP. I'm never gonna die. Fucking immortal. That's right, there was that gate that's closed, so I can't go that way. get over there. Was there a path up top that I did not see? No, I fell. Right, because even even if we were doing thirty, even if we were doing a hundred, it would be three health per hit. We're we are we're effectively immortal. You hit me. Prepare to die. kill you. <laughs> like, for the amount of healing I have... What is my 96 hit points? It's closer to like 100% leech. Ah, fuck my knees.
So if I was doing 100 damage per hit, of oh, 3% of total health? Even then. You know what it could be? All right, let's let's assume it's 3% of my health per hit. But then what it's doing, I think, is this could make sense. If it's doing 3% of health per hit, but that counts as four hits, and it could be procking from each damage distance. So physical fire, physical fire, so that in one attack, I'm getting 12% of my health back per hit. That would add up. Because I'm doing a physical hit, fire hit, physical hit, fire hit. So maybe that's why? Like, that would actually make sense. If, if it, the math is math and like that, that would, that would make sense. Yeah, because if it was just... Well, I think it's because one, two. I think that's counting as two hits. So even if it's not doing damage distance, that's 6% of health every time I swing. I gotta get that loot. You're stuck. I'm gonna wear your teeth. Yeah, we're literally immortal. There's there's no chance of me ever dying. Day one, learn basic mechanics. Day two, become a god. I don't think, oh, I don't think a swarm would even kill me, bro. Because if they're swarming me, that's just more targets to hit and more healing. What can I say? I'm just built different. This, is, this was very good. The uh, slush. Try a boss? When we find a boss, the boss is gonna try me. And please don't stop. I don't want to die. Please don't. <laughs> Come here. Come here, loot pinata. Like the only the only risk I can see of death would be getting stun locked. Part of me feels like I should take off my loot. Because I'm too strong. But at the same time, no. It's fucking stupid. Oh my god, dude. 
Literally the only thing, the only possible thing that could kill me now is gravity. How do you roll with your weight so high? Rolling is not necessary. But what do you do to survive? You kill them. What about your health? It refills. The sword was just enchanted. I just, uh... I enchanted it, and the random misfix combo I got was insane. So I've now become a god. I RNG'd my way into unlimited power. I want to get up to you and murder you. Yeah, I wonder if the other heal- because I do have a lot of healing effects, so if they're compounding, that would also explain the absurdity of what's happening. Because that 3% is actually, like, a bajillion. <laughs> Divine Scimitar. We just found a, a, a newer weapon, let's see. Two-handed curved greatsword. Oh, it's quality scaling? Rip. I'm sure you're good, but I'm not using you. Yeah, there really isn't a need for heals. I have heals, but like, what would I fucking... When would I ever... I don't know when I would need to use them now. 33 damage. Extra fire damage. So all... all apparently all you need is just health on damage. Well, I wonder... I wonder if the, the fire compounds it in some capacity. Oh, trust me, I'm looking for a boss. I have full confidence that this would find a boss and just... Fuck! I didn't even notice the icon that my shit was about to break. Because I was too busy destroying lives. Goodbye, Iron Ore. I think we're about done with this section, though. This is where we fought the wolves. No, oh, hang on, I can go up. Oh, there's a fast travel over there. And a ladder. It's by the cooking area. I gotta go buy another iron there. No stats are necessary besides the power. You dare hit me now. Now it is my turn. Bum 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 Super attack powers. I need a fast travel. I need a fast travel. There's too much ore I'm leaving behind. I 
I don't want to leave behind all this ore. There's ore there. There's ore back where we killed dude. Oh, nice. All right, with this open, I think I can get back to my fast travel faster. Yeah, because this is where Dube was like, or nothing that way. Yo, it's a farm. Your plague bullshit does fucking nothing to me. Yeah, this is like a hundred percent leech barbarian in Diablo 2. Which like Boss! Oh god, he grabbed me! Yo, I found something killed me, chat! The game's not over. There's still a chance I can die. <laughs> ah. We need the iron ingots to upgrade it more. Alright, let me sell you some shit, buddy. I got old claymore. I don't think I'm well actually let me take juggle juggle. Well no, juggle strike is okay. Why not? I'll take it out anyway. I felt Hello. Alright. Staff with fireball. Armor increase, deal electric on block, gain health on block. What the fuck? I'm keeping that. <laughs> I just block forever and I'm invincible. And then I block and I parry once and I refill stamina. Oh my goodness. I need to find a good one-hander. You look like you could be solid. I need a little bit of int to use you, but... Quality one, I'm not using that. Focus gain. Damn, kite shield, 22 faith. May your will be half as strong. Hello. Heat enchantment. Strength and one point in int. Ignore all Steam reviews. Steam reviews are written by people that have the brain capacity of two marbles on a Beyblade board. Let's go back to that farm. <clears throat> I want to try and lure that thing out and then smack it. Mm. 
Where was it? It was over there, I think. back out if it can grab you it can kill you we're not letting that happen though it's like a farm mimic You can always go back and grind. I want to find a crazy one-hander to try the shield block build. And just see if I become invincible block man. Not sure why exactly I'm moving that. I feel like there's a reason, but I don't know what it is. Alright, let's go get the iron ore we missed. How did I got did I equip it? Yeah I did. that one tax deal plague focus on damage dealt indestructible and eh, I'll pull I'll either sell you or I'll pull limit break off of you there was a door near the farm I did not see this door you speak of about that door we did this this had a bunch of shit we murdered Invincible sword. I am a god. Killing everything. Well, that was a bit janky. I need a better fast travel. Yeah, it's time of day. Oh, 
Oh, I'm dumb. But there's one right here. All right, hold up. Let me, um... I don't think those lose damage when I fall, but... Since we're trying to get loot... We're gonna get- I saw a thing I could jump to. Um, let me put it all on. All right, let's go back up. Let's go get our iron ore. And then we'll come down and we'll kill everything. Okay, where was my ore? There was an ore... Excuse me, sir. You seen where my ore went? <laughs> Wish the jumps were a little snappier. That'll get, that'll get fucking tedious real fast. What's crazy is when we go back to town, we're going to have the resources needed to upgrade this weapon so it's even stronger, which will pretty much just mean we're, like, like we're already unkillable, but we're just going to do even more damage. The only threat to me is gravity. Damn, it's down to 16 already? These things do not last long. I will say, the, uh, the durability on gathering tools could definitely use an adjustment. Because... That sucks. You mine like two things and it's like, oh, I'm gonna break. Like, what the fuck? Brand new iron pickaxe. What do you mean you're gonna break? The iron's hard. Like, that's your job. Your job is to mine iron. What are you, what are you fucking talking about breaking? You're gonna break after two nodes and you're useless. You failed at your primary function. 
Like a sandwich that's not meant to be eaten. Why do you exist? Can't see shit. Where am I going? It's okay. We can go back to base, upgrade our shit. When does this game come out? It's out. Have they announced it yet? Yes, it's out. You know, I don't want to sound like a dick, but some of y'all could really do with, like, basic internet searching. There's this thing called Google. And it'll answer a lot of, a lot of the, the basic questions. Just want to put that out there. It's really, you should try it. It's really cool. How much are you worth if I sell you? One silver. Uh, I'll probably find another one. I'll sell you. Nothing sings like Steve. Good day. Do I got juke garment? Sure, I guess. What's next? I should have been. You look like salvation to our second island. island. Hi. Hi. One spruce wood. Thought I found more than that. I'll get more iron ore and spruce wood. Advanced weapons and armors. Yeah, we're gonna focus that. Sacrament. How's inventory look? Ooh, we're almost full. Probably run by and deposit some shit. The brings salvation to our I don't know if our soundboard works. Let's see. It's no hassle. Yeah, it does. But um, let's get all to I'm work. sick. They're gonna get away. I I'm just which which no no. Who's there? Maybe it's time you trade in that silly outfit for a uniform. I used to do a lot of like crazy. I used to use the soundboard a lot. Just don't. I'm too tired and old these days to do all that. I'm like, eh. I'm just gonna sit and play my game and be happy. PC performance is fine. Probably 144. Honestly, Steam Deck hitting 30 should be like the goal. Your Steam Deck, if a game can hit 30 FPS on Steam Deck, like, that's good. It's very good. Hang on, my trainers text me something. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Look at that later. You, you're not the Inquisition. They came like a fire, not seeing, only burning. But some prisoners fled before the madrigal came. Sought safety in the Serum room. The two who led the escape. <laughs> they... If the Torn don't kill you. The Riven Twins. Oh, you got parried. Now you're dead. say I'm too old for it I mean I'm too old for all the the extra bullshit you know I just want to play the game oh I don't, I don't want to like oh I died and then do like a womp womp and then you know no I don't need to do all the all the extra I'm just I'm happy just just playing the game Ron has his, uh... <laughs> that, that, that fucking attack is just... Ultimate murder fest every time I do it. Yeah, like I had, I had like a sad trombone thing on my, my board. I don't even know if that works anymore. Let's see. That one doesn't. That one doesn't. Yeah, a lot of them aren't even like. A lot of them aren't even. They're not even like linked to the right soundbite anymore. They're just there. They exist. What is this weapon? Uh, the immortal sword of burning obliteration. When you're gonna fight the boss, you need to parry his one hand away. And then when he swings with his second weapon, you parry it. And then you gotta go up, up, down, down, uh, LR, AB start, and your character does a special animation where he grabs the two swords and he combines them. And then he dips them in fire to ignite them and kills the boss, and then you get this super cool sword. Killed me. Damn, that kebab did some big fucking healing. up. No, that looks like it ends here. Ow, my ankles. I 
got to get up to there. I just go this way, go around. Makes sense. Want to get the shit to upgrade the uh, the smithy to get my ore faster. The smithy and the enchanter are the only things I really care about. Everything else is just like, hey, good. Like upgrading the smithy. That's important. And upgrading the enchanter so I can continue to get insanely rare shit is also important. Uh, I gotta get up top to open this thing. What are y'all liking more, the fire effects or the ice effects we had? The fire does look pretty fucking cool. Just the way it like carves across the ground and leaves flame all over. But the ice was cool too. Didn't I have one that did like plague? Oh, a two-handed great axe. What one do you look like? Damn, it's slow as fuck. Pretty aggressive. Does it not have a charge attack, though? I don't dislike it, but it is kind of like, eh. It's kind of, uh, you know, very, very simple. I haven't even tried Pulse of Health. That requires a hundred. I don't like that. The other one's better. Not that it matters, because the sword is... God tier anyway. That seems kind of boring compared to the other one.
I don't know if there's elemental effects on stuff, but I feel like fire should cause damage over time. I should freeze. Well, that was close. I noticed it was almost... Damn, how close was it? Ten? Fuck. That was about to break. Another day out, gotta farm for that ore, gotta get it fast, upgrade that ore. Smith is slow and it needs to be fast. Craft my ore so I don't get bashed. Make my sword really strong, killing baddies all day long. With this sword I will slay you, infinite health. Boom, boom, boom. It's a nice axe you got, unfortunately, X spam. Daggers. Oh, I know where we're at. Using a dance dance revolution dance pad. Mud in your mouth. Death combo. <laughs> I think two focus bars sounds good. We'll upgrade to have two focus bars. I'm half tempted to like make a video on this. Like, hey do this and you become an unstoppable god but at the same time there's another part of me that's all like golem about it and i'm like no my precious no one else must have this if you tell them the devs will nerf ease I think it can get through it. Come on. I believe in you, Pickaxe. You can do it. One more. Oh, good job, Pickaxe. have a one-hander I can use <clears throat> so I could actually try the the block thing two-handed halberd that requires decks
Need a one-hander. I think the, the joy in speed runs comes from just figuring out just how much faster you can do something. Okay, I think we've cleared out all that. Looks good. Let's warp. We probably need to uh, repair some shit. Actually, I think we're about to, like, go deeper into the mine, so we might... We might be at a point... Yeah, hang on. Let's... Ah, I see, I see. disappointing. Three hours. What time is it? One thirty. It's so early. Friday streams do be hitting different. I think at some point I may go drop the day job, just pay for insurance. So I do like the idea of just waking up and being able to just stream and not worry about the day job at all, but... I think I'd want to get it, keep it... Get it a little, a little more solidified first. I just hate the idea of paying for my own insurance. Because I know when you paying for your own insurance, it's fucking ass. Be silent as a whisper, or loud as a thundercloud. May your will be half as strong as my work. Hello. Ah. Make it stronger. 
iron, silver, copper ingot, and bear paws. I have no bear paws. I mean, I think Ori's done. I don't think there's a... Uh, as far as I know, I don't think there's plans for a third Ori. You look like the adventure. Hey, Smithy. Alright, that takes care of that. Iron ore. What else needed iron ore? The elevator needs some iron ore. That's been contributed. The enchantment shop needs iron ore. Also contributed. I need to just go out and find spruce wood and, like, just spend time cutting fucking trees down. Nah, I still, I still have the normal job because it's a pretty low workload. I mean, it's work from home. And I get all the health benefits of it. Like, if it was just me, I probably wouldn't because I would rather just pay for when I have to go to the doctor, but... I mean, kids go to the doctor constantly. So, I think it's important to have it since I have kids. I should go sell some of this. <sighs> or he has some trouble with his AMD cards. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm running smooth. I don't know what... Let's see. I don't know what, uh... Let me turn on NVIDIA overlay. And I'll tell you what I'm getting for frames. I always have trouble with the NVIDIA overlay not wanting to work right. I would assume I'm... I would assume I'm getting over 100 frames, like... I haven't been having any any performance issues. I'll keep you. I might put a point in you. Um. No. 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 Oh. Dude, what's the best one-handed weapon you got? Buried some shit, it would be that. But I ain't putting 16 into that. Crazy. Oh, you sell ironing. Oh, you have one. Oh, no, you have an infinite. All right, hold up. Look at my upgrades. Armor shards. Why? Why are you now, man? I just deposited all that shit. The early access build. Um, gathering tool durability should be turned down about fifty percent. Crafting should pull from anything that's in your stash and base. Um. Health to damage effects are broken, and they make you a god. <sighs> I'm having a lot of fun with it. Would recommend. I don't want to get up to like a big boss, and then I think that's where we'll work out.
I'm gonna go down there to reach stuff probably. I do gotta I'll probably wrap up in a little bit here, because I forgot I gotta we're doing a charity stream tomorrow. I gotta set up everything for the charity stream. It is for uh it's uh games for love which is a charity that like helps kids in hospitals uh let's see I'll read more about it tomorrow. But there, I'm supposed to set up like stretch goals and all sorts of other stuff and I just keep playing games and I haven't had time. But I gotta, I, I gotta get that shit set up for the stream. And we'll probably play this. I like to do... Usually... Uh, like, I think two two charity streams per year, I think, is a, is a decent metric. I don't like doing them too frequently because I think the thing with charity streams is like yeah it's always good to do charity streams but I think if you overdo them you end up like stretching your audience then you know like if you're doing a charity stream every month you know like after a while people are like I ain't got money to help the fucking kids I, I gotta put food on my table and so You know, I think it's, uh... Oh god, I'm gonna drown. I was all tabbed and looking at something. I think it's important to, like, keep... Keep in mind how often you do charity streams. Okay, Chungus, listen. Dun, 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 dun. Oh no, he interrupted my attack and I was half dead already. Rip. Hold up, we're gonna... Damn. Where did Chungus go? Chungus got that kill because I wasn't paying attention.
time is it? It's two o'clock. Go to the gym at four. Oh, All right, you know what? Let's say, let's say I go for. I'll go till about three. Should be good. If I go till three, that'll give me enough time to. I can get everything set up for the charity stream. Well, I do gotta record Final Fantasy for tomorrow, still. I haven't done that yet. Maybe I should wrap up soon. Let's see, if we can get to a, if we can get to the boss within the next hour, we'll call it at the boss. Because I I think I think we all want to see just how ridiculous this build would be against a boss. Hmm? Any total episodes? I don't know. There, there haven't been any early access episodes for Final Fantasy 16 because I've only been recording two every day so far. I just, I haven't had time. That's it. They didn't do, like, so you, oh, usually, usually when I'm recording a game, you know, we have it in advance. But <clears throat> since it was just a DLC and it was a PlayStation DLC, like, stream DLCs are a little bit, or Steam, Steam DLCs are a little bit different because they can just like upload a build. Um, but PlayStation type DLCs, it's not easy to just like unlock it early. So there was just no chance to, to get Rising Tide done in advance. Whereas like usually, you know, like Stellar Blade is done. I already, I've, you know, the review is coming up. I've beat it. I have a fuckload of episodes recorded already. That'll be early access like normal, but Rising Tide, I like, I woke up to record Rising Tide. Well, not woke up, but I basically was up till midnight on uh, Wednesday night so I could jump right in and start recording Rising Tide. So just, uh, you know, and then between streams and whatnot, there just hasn't been a chance to really like push content out yet. I can't get through that. I think I go. Uh, 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 yes. There we go. It is your moral duty to set me free, and me as well. How can you help? You don't have hands. Dark after the embargo drops. That'd be a good idea. I'm sure, there's gonna be people trying to spoil stuff. Right now, my plan for Stellar Blade is gonna be uh, two episodes per day of the Let's Play, and then. I plan on having a uh, combat guide that I'm gonna do in the training area. So we'll cover like all the mechanics of the game, including late game mechanics. So some spoilers there, but everything will be in the uh, in the training zone. So you won't actually like see late game zones or late game areas or anything like that. So I think that's a good I think that's a good way to produce a guide for it. I was thinking about doing a guide on like 
outfits, but I don't remember where I got stuff, so it would just be like, here are all the sexy outfits I have. <laughs> it seems kind of weird for a, uh, for a guide, like, look at all the outfits Eve can get. So I don't think I'm going to do that. I'll probably just focus on the combat guide because there's... There, there is a lot of stuff with combat, which I learned playing through, that I think will really help people. I've already been helping people. There's been people that have gotten stuck, and I've been like, do this. Stellar Blade, sexy outfit showcase. Possible for you to create a dedicated review playlist on your channel? Uh, yes and no. Like, on one hand, I could, but the problem would be that some older titles, the review was part of the series, you know, because like I always review during the credit roll. So, I don't know. Like, would I add those in? Or would it just be a playlist of, like, standalone reviews? Do the wall glitch in the demo? No. Why would I do the wall glitch in the demo when I have the full game? It's waste of time. This area is fucking huge, dude. It just keeps going. I think I can go down from here. Yeah. I was looking at that plank. I think there's a uh, some pathing type stuff I can do over there. That looks like it leads to a boss. Mm. I don't really like this drop. Shit, shit, shit. Am I supposed to? No, I don't know, man. I don't like this. Am I supposed to drop down onto that? That didn't fucking work. I gotta go, uh repair my shit's about to break let me repair and then we'll go take another look at that oh damn it go <laughs> Ignore mixed reviews. Game is good. People are dumb.
honestly, all it boils down to, man, if if a game was actually bad, right? If this was actually, <clears throat> if the mixed reviews were accurate, nobody would be streaming it right now. Like at the end of the day, if a game is fun to play, that's the most important thing that's going to determine whether or not people are going to play it or engage with it. And so every time a new game comes out and the fucking smooth brain morons on Steam get upset about something and bombard it with mixed reviews, you still have like shit tons of people playing it. And then you end up in this loop of, well, Steam said it's mixed. Well, Steam is fucking stupid. Steam is like the lowest common denominator of intelligence that it was still allowed on the internet. I don't know if I can get to that from here. I'd have to run. I'm just going to skip that. I don't know what the hell that is. We already have God Sword. Probably shouldn't have used that, but like honestly, what's the chance of me actually dying? Transition's getting a little framey there. Go this way or go down? <laughs> Steamy viewers pull their pants all the way down at the urinal in the men's room. It's an oddly specific insult. I like it. This area is chugging on frames, weird. Let's go this way. I still didn't free that dude that was stuck in the prison. Wait, can I cut this wood down? Open in peace on closed days of suffering, whispers of the slayer from her chamber to the west. Okay. The gate to the holy city did not fall shut without reason. The ancients built it to defend against the plague. The ancients are dead, Governor. It's our duty, not theirs, to save the people of Kalin. Can you not hear them yourself, crying out for help, calling us through the stone? I hear nothing. The mountain won't yield to your words the way men do. Of course it will. All I need is someone who speaks its language. Hmm. I don't want to really do that yet. Let me go back. Maybe I'll try and rescue that weirdo. I don't like Framy Land. Let me go there. It was, there was all that shit about, like, free me, and the dude's like, these guys will try and kill you. It's over here. Can I take this path? Ooh, ooh. Take it down.
Just take me near the, uh... Yeah. I ain't got time to kill gods. I'm trying to cut down trees. Everybody and their mother is like, we need spruce. And I'm like, I don't have any. And they're like, find the spruce. Which I want to. I don't know where it's at. God damn it, dude. Some of these jumps. Right, it's this way. You can hold the dodge button to go fast. Let's try doing it from here. This brings me over to this. Which is that ladder that I used a second ago. Alright, that's the beam that I was trying to drop to earlier. God damn it. You stop fucking falling everywhere. Where was the dude that was trapped that was all like, rescue me? He was like over here? Combat is so, so evolving. It's just so much evolution. It went from smacking people with a big sword to smacking them with a faster, bigger sword. That weaves fire across the ground. Like a dance of the blazing sun at moonlight. Like this. Uh, will I grab that ledge from here? Nope. I mean, that's the closest we've gotten to it. I just don't want to go talk to Creepy Lady. So I'm doing everything I can to avoid talking to Creepy Lady. Fuck. 
I mean, there has to be something I can only access by jumping across that. Otherwise, what would be the point of it? You know? I might be giving up attempts at that treasure. I don't know. It's like I want to get it, but at the same time, I'm like, this is a pain in the ass. I'm tired of running for this. It's a long fucking fall every time I run. I don't know if that treasure is important enough to me to justify the amount of running that I'm having to do currently to achieve it. probably important. That probably lets the guy out. Alright, now I gotta remember where that guy was. He was up top. Uh, from what we tested, weight did not have an impact on our ability. Uh, it didn't have an impact on fall damage. I don't believe it has an impact on weight. It seems it only has... I'm a traveler, like you. Of many realms. Spectral, astral, temporal. But you must free. Ah, uh, yes. I can feel the wind of the... Ah, oh, my thanks, Serum. My name is Finley. I traffic in the inconceivable. My search for oddities led me uh, to this unenviable position. Now, in my untethered form, I shall return to Saturn. Only the heavens know. You have some fine... I shall have to part you trade in wares as valuable as... I have a feeling that guy probably has, like really good shit like rare rings or something oops all spikes all right so how's our durability looking right now missing about a third of it all right let's go talk to creepy lady I go this way? Is this another path? Nope, you die if you go that way. I feel like you can go that way. I gotta just find the way down. What about like right here? That... Oh no, because it's that's it's where they're at, so the game doesn't want you to go that way. So what are we at now? We were at 70 out of 100. Now we're at 50, so it's 10% durability loss per death. I did look at the next update for V-Rising. Gonna be good. PvP zones, Dracula. Their ability system isn't bad at all. You just watched me repair gear, it took 20 seconds. 
why I'm putting that on. I should... Oh, like that or something. Did I get down to them before? Oh, this way. Yeah, it's something with the rain here. I think the rain is what's plummeting the frames. Tender of the words. Speaker of the dead. Those who walk between the rain. There's a beauty to the old names. <laughs> Surprised I recognize you, Serum. I... The church considered it forbidden knowledge. Old fools hiding from what they don't understand. But I think we understand each other. There is an inscription at the base of the gate. This. Go to the chamber. And be seen by... Okay. As long as it fixes the frames, I'll go that way. It's a big chamber. I just want a boss fight. Bro, I'm busy getting ore. Stop with your fireballs. I'll get to you in, in a moment. Really shouldn't worry about grinding food. You should just have plenty. Like I have uh, 19 of those and then fuck loads of mushrooms. But the better thing is to find heal effects like this. Gain health on damage dealt. Or this. Gain health on block. Can I use the scimitar? Nope. I'm curious. Oh god, no, don't destroy it. I want to see how much the... I want to see how OP the health on block mechanic is. Get over to there. Uh, 
All right, well, let them hit me a little bit. All right, now we'll block. I'm getting a lot of focus, but not a lot of health. Maybe it's because I don't have a primary. Or could it be because I'm lagged? Maybe it's because I was plagued. I think it might, I don't know. We're gonna test it in a second. I feel like it stopped working when I had both of them on, so maybe you can only have one instance at a time. I'll let this thing hit me. It also might be that I need to have I need a one-hander that I can use with it to like oh I keep finding lots of one-handers, but it's shit I can't use. I gotta find one. Let me go, let me go by town and try to buy just like any one-hander I can find that I can actually equip. And then, uh, we'll be able to test the shield out and see if it works or if it's just something with the sword. Good day. I could use the clerics mace, I guess. Feels like a big waste. But I'll buy it. Experience loss on damage taken. Increase stamina by 8 for 20 seconds after parry poise defense. No. Let's go see if the, the health on hit works with the shield. So right now it's gain health on block. These are my scissors? No, these are my scissors. I should have been. Boss fight. Definitely a boss fight. I am the trees. Some of them made. Oh, I mean. When we took their eyes and cut their throats. But there are no gods to ask. Not even yours. Yeah, I'm trying to block. 
All right, the block doesn't seem that good. Right, listen, Mr. Spindlewind. Got a, he's got a lot of spinny to winny. Yeah, so the shield does not work. The sword sure as fuck does, though. Alright, we are gonna put on blade oil. I might actually need to, like, pay attention a little bit here. That hits you even when you're down. Damn. I wonder if I can parry that big sweep he does. Y'all think I can parry it? Oh god, I was like, what is he doing? Um, I'm not sure if I can parry that attack. Oh true, I should work in my shoulder checks. Spin to win is so fucking obnoxious, dude. got a legendary or unique or something one-handed rapier 12 percent three percent health on damage dealt stamina refill on parry damn bro shit needs 16 points in intelligence and 16 points in faith when would i fucking use that i ain't gonna use that 
Man. That's some bullshit. I have a super cool piece of unique loot. It's amazing. By the way, you're not going to use this. It's the opposite of the build you're doing. Yeah, I wanted the leg sword. The first boss didn't give it to me. But I think the one I have is better anyway, so... four levels of points to use that thing. What sucks is I can't even like equip it to try it out to see if like maybe I'd want to use this. I gotta like find somebody that has like a really badass strength weapon. Even your own history rejects you. Fuck, lady. But my purpose is clear. An arrow pointed straight through this stone. Go now, Serum. This is not your story, not. Go oh, now where? Alright, so that's good. Um more stamina, one point per, four points per, it's good health. I don't know what to do. Did I get another... I didn't even get a thingy off of him. Iker. Oh, what the fuck do I do? Is the, is the portal not open? We should not linger. The Madrigal has no further use for us. I pray we both may... Okay, well... Uh, I am the true boss. The sword that heals. I need trees to cut. Well, we killed the boss. Um, what the fuck we're supposed to do? Is I... Like you can still be of use in sacrament. But like, what else? Is that like the end of early access? So all we have is spilled blood. That gate was- the gate was still closed. Hang on, did we reach the end of early access? Let's see. No rest for the wicked early access length. Um, early access version is going to feature 15 to 25 hours of gameplay for a playthrough of the campaign, as well as the Crucible endgame dungeon. Alright. Go to the top of town. Oh, here we go. People of Sacrament. My people. We find ourselves in a place we never sought, under the eyes of history. A plague that spent a thousand years confined to stories is now clawing at our gate. The threat of anarchy swells beneath us. Gods chosen descend from on high, and none of us can say what tomorrow will bring. But what I know 
is that our stone walls do not compare to the strength of our will. And I know both will withstand whatever rises against sacrament, no matter the cost. History has called upon us, and history will remember how we answer. Serim! Serim, I, I must speak with you. The eyes of history trained on our city, but there may be more to sacrament than we know. I I've been digging through old tomes to perhaps learn about the strange chamber that Elsa discovered beneath the cemetery. I think I may have found the answer she needs. It please, take this book to Elsa for me. Uh, Tell her it's from Roan. I, I mean, if she asks, <laughs> she knows who I am, of course. Not that it's her fault if she doesn't. Um, thank you, Sarah. All right. Well, we got our next quest. Um, let's wrap up here. We got the boss done. It looks like we're about to to go through the the cemetery and go to a whole new end area. So that seems like a a good spot to close out. We can tackle this tomorrow. So I'm gonna go ahead and figure out the stuff for the charity stream tomorrow. It's probably gonna be uh, early in the day, kind of like this, sometime around noon. So y'all have a good night. I'm going to head out and I'll catch y'all tomorrow with some more.